Welcome back, folks, to Let's Play Ultima 9 Ascension, and wait, last we left off, we were able to find the encampment of gypsies by Cove, and they were being accosted by Blackthorn. Blackthorn wanted the blue codex lens from their leader, and though the leader claimed that he didn't know anything about it, chances are that he was just trying to keep it from Blackthorn. Blackthorn killed a few of the gypsies before we intervened, and then Blackthorn placed a curse upon the gypsies to prevent them from helping us. It's not going to prevent everyone from helping us, but there are some people who are going to be less than keen to talk to us here. We then, following the advice of one of the gypsies, went through that waterfall and found where Julia had been staying. And we found a doll that belonged to the ghost girl, which we've now returned. After the game crashed still concerned that the game crashed so absolutely there. Now let us continue exploring here, and then go check out the area by that column. There's also a pathway up there that leads to a more mountainous region. First things first though, we have over here, and the leader. This person. Hello. Ah, uh, you must be the avatar, no? Morgana foretold your coming, and now, here you are. And what have you brought for me, huh? Brought for you? I have brought nothing for you. Do you not know? When you visit the Rom Baro, you come with gifts. Always should you bring gifts to one of great stature. Uh, I'm sorry, I don't have anything for you? Let's start again. I'm the Avatar. Who are you? Who are you? Who am I? <laughs> I am Laszlo, the Rambaro, the leader of the Gypsies. That is who I am. And you think you are the only one with destiny, Avatar. My fate was foretold when I was born. Myth and legend. Fated to the greater glory. Now, what you bring for me, eh? Nothing? What's this fate you're talking about, though? What is this fate that was foretold? It was foretold at my birth by Morgana that I would save my people from disaster. This is my fate and my destiny. Well, I hope you can avoid calamity for your people. With all due respect, Rumbaro, I come in search of very important items. <laughs> so, you come to the Rumbaro asking for many things, but you bring him nothing. Why not just spit in my face you show such disrespect? Tell you what. You tell me what it is you seek, and I tell you what you must bring me for these important things. That seems like a deal. Very well. I need the blue codex lens. And what else? The mantra and sigil of sacrifice. Hmm. You come here, you show me no respect, and now you ask me for these things. No, no, no. This I cannot do. Not unless you give me something that I need for my people. You see, my people have suffered very bad things because of this column so near our camp. Tell you what, Avatar. You bring me this thing that I need. Then we can talk about the lens. What do you think of that, eh? Seems like a deal. What is it that you need? What I need is the black rock crystal ball. This ball predicts the future and it is never wrong. You bring me this ball. And then we can talk about the lens. Also, black rock. Been a while since we've seen any of that. Where is this crystal ball? Ah, here is the problem. An ancient and powerful lich stole it and holds it in the Blackrock mines. This will be dangerous, sure, 
But you are the Avatar, no? Hm. That I am. But that's still a lich, and liches are no joke. Also, that does uh, explain why there are lots of undead within the mines. Very well. I'll bring you the crystal ball. Salut! See? We can work arrangement. You scratch my back, and I scratch yours. <laughs> I was never against trading for the items that uh, I need. Either way, let's talk to you. Stay far away from those lunatics in Cove. They're crazy, no? More accurately, they're under the influence of the column. Much like some of the people here. Hello. Leave me alone or I put a curse upon you. Okay, goodbye. What about this place here? This door is locked. Okay, we're not getting anywhere here. No keys amongst the chickens? Nope. And there doesn't appear to be a huge amount of stuff. And this is where that is the super secret place with the awesome things. The truly awesome things. Also, there is you. Hello. Old Morgana told us that you would come to the camp. I am Vaklov, the smith here. Come in and look at my whales. They are much better than the shoddy work in Cove, no? Not only that, but I have the best prices too. That sounds good. Since this is a special sale, I'll buy. What do you have? You have lots of chain equipment. Mace, target bow, dum-dum staff. Nothing really that I especially want, but good to know it's here. My items are the best, no? Surely you want to buy more. Actually, I, I haven't bought any. Also, I'm going to mention this. These prices seem oddly high, Vaklov. It is in Cove that you will find high prices, my friend, not here. Hmm. Do you know anything about the sigil and the mantra? Are you trying to get me killed? You must think I am a fool, no? Seriously, Avatar. You consider buying a gypsy breastplate. It is made of the special gypsy steel, much stronger than normal steel. The gypsy steel is woven of moonbeams and forged in righteous fires. Um... How much is it? Yes, Vaklov. I will buy it. Ooh! A thousand. Sure? I mean, if it's not good, we'll just end up getting this a thousand back? How good is it actually? Let, let's find out. This is when I've been absolutely ripped off. Gypsy breastplate. That's not actually equipped it. Let's put this here, and then do this. Can I actually equip this? N -n no. I'm trying to equip it. Hmm. Either I'm putting it on wrong, or it's not something I can actually equip. I don't think it is something I can equip. Oh well, it's only a thousand gold. We can get that gold back, I'm sure. Let us look about and see if we can, uh... Oh, well, there's something we can read here. The Big Bad Knight's Guide to Mercy. When fighting, it is not always necessary to kill one's opponent. Often a good hard hit with a non-bladed weapon can put them out of commission long enough for you to do whatever needs to be done, without taking their life. It is recommended to be far away when the victim recovers, however, for the resulting headache has been known to make people a bit crabby. That is... an understatement. Now let's go up here. Ooh! There is another wagon. Hello? Why, it is the Avatar, no? 
Yes, I remember you. We have met once before, but perhaps not in the way you believe. I see that it is your wish to help us rather than hurt us. For that, I will help you. I would never try and hurt you. What is your name, kind lady? My name is Morgana. Long have I lived here, and now I await the rest of eternal peace. Can you tell me about what's been happening here? Your help is greatly appreciated, good woman. Could you tell me what happened on this island? The Guardian and his servile footman Blackthorn have corrupted Minoc with the Glyph of Sacrifice. This glyph, it is located at the base of the Great Column. As a result, the gypsies have become greedy and selfish. Even the Rambaro is hoarding all the magic gifts he can lay his hands on. Neither will he listen to me as he once did. He does not see the greedy ways that he and his people have adopted. There is another island, too, where the hand of the Guardian has weighed heavily. Another island? Please tell me about this other island. A very spiritual place, the Isle of the Avatar. It has disappeared. Most think that it sunk beneath the waves. I do not know where the island is. But I do know that you must somehow find it. Upon this island, high in the mountains, is a sacred place where once the Codex of Ultimate Wisdom resided. I fear that you will be unable to read the Codex from any other location. This lady, for all the people saying that she can barely see, has a lot of clarity. And I appreciate the directness of her advice. Where is the entrance to the column? It is in the Black Rock Mines of Covetous. There you will also find the Black Rock Crystal Ball. This ball, it reveals the future without error. You can use the Crystal Ball to show the gypsies what will become of them if they do not change their selfish ways. That sounds like a good idea. May I have the mantra to the shrine? Yes, Avatar. It is Ka. Remember to use this mantra in your meditation, and the shrine will be restored, no? Now I have told you all that I can, and I may go to my rest. But first, I pronounce a curse on Blackthorn. He will die, alone, defeated by a man he betrayed, scorned by his only ally. Okay, maybe the curse from Blackthorn wasn't such a bluff after all. Also, saying that uh, Blackthorn would die alone, killed by a person he betrayed and abandoned by his only ally, there's a bit of foreshadowing. And there's a map. Also, there is the entrance to uh, the Mines of Covetous. Rather, the uh, Black Rock Mines. Pretty much one of the same. Now, we have explored there. I want to go and uh, check in with the shrine. I also want to go and get the money that I left there. And also see if there is a another crab. I do want that money. Did spend a thousand gold on something I can't use, after all. Not that I really desperately needed a thousand gold right now. Now, there is a... Uh, a thing to say. I don't need a thousand gold! Also, I know there's a little bit of gold in here. Also, another ghost! Hello! Don't mind me, just gonna equip this. Ha-ha! And you dropped a... Ooh, that's a potion. That's a pretty good potion. Also, you're frozen in place. I suppose it's quite apt, considering the weapon I hit you with. By the way, bit of gold here. This should, uh... Help me uh, recoup my finances nicely. Not the potion. The gold. Okay, it didn't do that much. It was 20 gold, but it'll help. Do want to go and check in with the shrine. And see if there are any more giant crabs. There are not going to be any more giant crabs, are there? 
No, there are not. Also, it looks like uh, things are getting a little bit brighter. Did leave gold here too. Or maybe that was just my imagination because things aren't actually getting brighter. Ah well. Another crab? No. In that case, I'll just take the gold. Gold here. Huge pile of gold there. And you two. Because you two are inevitably going to try and have at thee with me. And you really, really shouldn't. Also, it's got really dark because it's going to rain again. Thanks for the gold, though. I appreciate the gold. Really, I appreciate the gold. Brings me back up to 9,274. Now, let's meditate. Also, handy dandy uh, circle there. Speak now the mantra of sacrifice. I believe it is this. Now, the people of this land covet their neighbor's goods. And why is this? What has caused this travesty to befall the people of Minoc? The Guardian hath twisted me, the Shrine of Sacrifice, and so are the people's hearts twisted. Avatar, go amongst the people and find the sigil, for they have it. Find them the evil glyph, then come unto me and cleanse me of this evil. Sounds like a plan. So, I think how things are going to go is that we are going to, uh go and get this black rock uh, ball, show the uh, leader of the gypsies that if they don't uh, change their ways, they will basically destroy themselves. Then we'll be given the sigil, we'll find the glyph within Covetous, and hopefully when we cleanse the Shrine of Sacrifice, we will then have Raxos return to, ooh, also huge amounts of gold there. And a healing potion, considering we gave away a healing potion. This seems like a good thing to take. There we go, that puts us back up to 9,364. Not bad. Hopefully then everything will return to some form of normality. Keyword, some form, because, uh... Things are pretty bad. It'll take a while for uh, this place to recuperate. Also, definitely going under here, because... There could be something here? No? Just thought I'd have a look, just in case, but... There could be something. This cave is going on for quite a while. Oh, are we underwater? We are underwater there. Also, is that a pile of gold? No, that is a... No, I think that actually is a pile of gold. I'll have that, thank you. Ooh, boxes. I will most certainly take these boxes. Actually, I can't do anything with the boxes. A uh, healing potion? Won't say no to that. Might not actually be a healing potion. Either way, still more we can do here. This cave is going on for quite a ways. There probably won't be anything super awesome at the end of it. Still worth checking out, though. And it opens up. That's a cutlass, isn't it? Pretty sure that is a cutlass. Nope! That's the Gringolet! That seems like a very magic item indeed. Good thing I decided to swim all the way to the end, eh? Imagine missing that! How powerful is the Gringolet? Let's equip uh, the Sword of Frost, and then we will equip Gringolet. It's about as powerful. There's got to be something that uh, separates it from the uh, Sword of Frost, though. Couldn't tell you what, but hey, we've got it. You have respawned. Has the... Yep, the crab has respawned, and you know what? Before we go and uh, head towards the mine, we are definitely going to go and fight this crab another time. We may get another piece of plate mail. We probably won't. Now, if you want to reverse up, here we go. Have at thee! You should not be fighting the avatar. 
Okay, that's uh, not quite what I want. That is a set of leather leggings. I'd much prefer plate leggings, but they are a thing. Also, we nearly have the 1,000 gold back. And some people were worried that I'd have difficulty uh, accumulating uh, money. Also, it's gotten dark again because we got a bit too close to the shrine. How about thee? I'd like some money. 17? Sure. And you're also going to have at thee with me. Yep. One hit. That's all that took. And 52. You know what? I'm going to make a little bit of space here. We're not going to need that. So we'll just put that away. And we'll eat some cake. Because when everything crashed, I didn't eat the cake. Now let us make our way back. Just got to jump over to here. They really need to fix this bridge, but they're not going to do that. Because they're kind of thinking about themselves, and only themselves. Hello, Moon! Are you slowly getting closer to Britannia? Is this slowly floating above the ground? Is that ghost just waiting to attack someone? I think that ghost is. Now, the way we want to go is over here now. Past there, and up this. Also, there is a uh, tent here we haven't been to. There's also you! Oh, you really want to try and fight me, do you? One hit. That's all it took. Anyone in here? Yes, you're stood on that. You don't mind if I smash this open, do you? Nope. Excellent. Let's say hi. That Irina. She is such a hussy. She thinks that she's the prettiest girl in the camp, and she's been spoiled rotten. All because her father is the rum barrel. Hey, be careful there. You break something in here, you buy it. I already broke something. Fortunately, I can't buy boxes. What is the Rambaro? The Rambaro is the leader of the gypsy people. That Irina Hussey, she is his daughter. And who are you? And who are you? I am Elena. I buy and sell the magic items. You come and see what I have to sell, no? Why not? Certainly. I have nothing but the finest goods and always at the best prices. What have you got? Reagents? Spells? Telekinesis? Do I have to? I don't think I have telekinesis. You know what? We'll buy telekinesis. Thank you for your business. No problem. Thank you. Goodbye. Yeah. Next time you come here, you buy something. Hey, I bought something! Also, I'm reading this scroll. I can't read that scroll. Oh well. I'll drink your potion then. That's what you think about me buying stuff and then claiming I don't buy things. Now I've drunk your potion. Also, a binding circle. This is quite fortuitous. Telekinesis is... This is one I already have it. No, I don't! Ort, Paul, Lem. That's Mandrake Root, Blood Moss, and Black Pearl. Better actually uh, write down that uh, that mantra so that I don't forget it. Ort, Paul, Lem. Always have a uh, pencil and paper with you. And uh, Black Pearl, Blood Moss, Mandrake Root. Got it. Let's bind this! Might as well do it while I'm here. That is not the thing I want. Actually, I want this. So, put that there. That's not the reagents bag. This is the reagents bag. I want... Black Pearl, Blood Moss, and the Mandrake Root. There we go. And then, I will light everything! And then I will grab all of my reagents back. Because why use them? Why spend money, even though I'm hoarding it, when I don't need to? So, Ort, Paw, Lem. And there we go! Telekinesis has been added to my spell repertoire. And these are going to be added back to my reagents bag. 
I think with that, we, yep, have every single spell in the second circle. And we're only missing two from the third circle. And so, when we come back, folks, we will continue over here, which will likely take me to the mine. And if it doesn't, eh, I think that's definitely the way to the mine I see undead there. Generally good indicator that there's a lich about, huge amounts of undead. And so, I'll catch you next time, folks, and I'll see you then. Later. Also, lots of lava here. Not a safe place to be at all. You really should think about moving your camp.